Raider Nation YouTube. Avakazi Raider, Raider Critique on six, back for the third round selection, day two. They're about to announce it. Jim Plunkett. Hang on. Here we go. What do you think, guys? I know who Hang I want on. this to be. Come on. The Las Vegas Raiders select Delmar Glenn. There we go. We doubled up on offensive line. Delma Glaze from Maryland. Offensive tackle. What's up, man? Looks like he's lining he's up the left. Shit. Right offensive line. We got our right tackle, our right guard, and powers. And now we got a playmaker on offense. Lordy Lord. Lordy Lord. Can you say happy? By his tape, right. it looks like he's predominantly left. Hell yeah. Right. Left and right from what I understand. Uh, so if we can move him over to the right tackle and solidify that spot, that'd be nice. Nice. What about you, uh, Critique? How you feeling? Hey, I'm I'm glad to see that we're protecting what we've got, whether it's Aiden O'Connell, Garner Minshew, or that other cat that we uh, – what, what is his last name? Porter? You know what I mean? Probably not even going to make the damn team. He's going to wind up being a practice squad player anyway. But if we can solidify that and develop a good running game, you know, it all starts in the trenches, man. A lot of these – so they're not glorified picks. No, they're not glorified picks. But the games are won in the trenches. And that's what a lot of you newbies don't understand is that what those guys do on that line really projects on how the game goes – offensively and defensively for both teams. They set the momentum, man. It's like sitting there saying the base player don't have a fucking job. We set the rhythm. <laughs> I love it. On six. I love the pick, man, especially if uh, he can solidify the right side of the offensive line now with powers. And it means the, the uh, I mean, all we need now is a fucking cornerback. I like the draft so far. A plus so far for Tom Palesco and AP in their draft, man. I was a little worried with the Brock Bowers pick, but now I'm liking the whole draft as general. So hopefully we can keep it up, man. So, so far, three picks in, I'm happy. Right. And I guess with the with the Brock Bowers pick, like we all had to look, a lot of us, including myself, had to let it marinate for a little bit to come around because the guy is a stud and a playmaker. Um, it's just we didn't really, a lot of us, including myself, didn't do the extensive research to, to see that because we didn't think tight end was a high priority, especially in round one. But in regards to Delmar Glaze, yeah, Delmar Glaze, Delmar Glaze from Maryland. So, drafting another offensive lineman, I like it. Um, I still believe Thayer Mumford can provide competition to maybe solidify that right tackle. But if it's this guy, cool, yeah. I'm with it. So we could always use more depth in the trenches, like you said, critique. It might not be the sexy picks, but it's definitely somewhere that's of great importance for whoever's that quarterback for our running game and just for everything to move. You know what I'm saying, like. You, you need that right. offensive line. I mean, to be they get another piece thought, there. I'm all for it. Who would have thought that tight end would have been even our first pick, regardless on who the person is, whether he's a Swiss Army knife or not, especially after drafting a tight end last year, who was supposed to be baby Gronk. But from what I hear through Getsy, man, Solo's got a real good point. Dude likes to run a lot of dual tight end sets. And they, you know, Thayer Munford can block, but we're going to have to, you know, we don't need dudes like Alex Bars. We don't need dudes like fucking Van Rotten. You know what I mean? We, we, we need to solidify those positions and get young guys in here who are going to be here for years to come. Not yeah, these get makeshift uh, plug and play guys that we're pulling in from free agency. So, I mean, build from the trenches and build out, man. I, I, I love it. I love it. I hope we have uh, better luck uh, with uh, Del Marquez uh, or um, you know, Jackson Powers uh, Johnson, um, both offensive linemen. Hopefully they can be, as you said, integral key pieces for our offensive line moving forward for years to come. But Del Marquez, welcome to the Raider Nation offensive tack from Maryland. Uh, let's see what kind of role we have in store for you or if you can earn that job starting somewhere in time. Anyways, I'm Afrikasi Raider, Raider Critique, on Six Soldier. Leave your comments down below. Let us know what you think. Um, I'm, I'm very happy with how the draft has shaked out so far. And, um, yeah, bring on day three. <laughs> All right, chat. We'll catch you on the flip side for sure. Bye.
vocês, tá ligado? 